His name was Geralt of Rivia. He was a witcher, a professional monster slayer. An unusual contract to lift the curse that held a monarch's daughter. It was enough to spend the night with the princess, dusk till dawn. If only she were not a deadly beast, a striga. The traitor responsible for the curse became the bait.
Though gravely wounded, the Witcher lifted the curse and gained fame. The world changed with the coming of the Great War, the time of the sword and axe, the time of disdain. Geralt of Rivia disappeared, all but forgotten. But that's another story. Ladies and gentlemen, you have no idea how long I've wanted to bring you this Let's Play of The Witcher. It's one of my personal favourite games that cannot be beaten by any other games. But the thing is, is I don't really want to start into the gameplay in this part. There's only very little that my hard drive can handle right now as uh, most of my hard drive space is taken up. I will fix that for the next time. Plus, I don't really want to start a story and then have to cut part of it because YouTube might refuse to upload it. So instead of going straight on in, we're going to do a very Total Biscuit style thing and spend maybe a couple of minutes looking through all the different options that we have. Um, just so you guys know, this is not a blind let's play by any rate. I have finished the story and I'm if I'm honest I wasn't happy about the ending that I got but I'm not gonna let it affect my choices I'm gonna choose the things that I feel that Geralt as a Witcher would do I haven't only played the games but I've read the books as well and yes I am a dirty human being and have pre-ordered the third one which will be something on my channel a lot later because I won't bring that to my channel until I have done the other two. I might do a quick thoughts on The Witcher 3 and see how they've developed it so far, even though I am slightly annoyed at the fact that they're going to be bringing out, uh, well they've already bought out a pre-order DLC, not something I agree that game companies should do, it's turning into a bit like, something like, a bit like Ubisoft, which in my opinion is not the right way to go for them. But let's just move on slightly, uh, obviously the sound's going to have to be turned down a slight bit so it just means that I have full uh, focus on my voice but also I will be muting my voice during the gameplay itself. We are going to be doing this on the hardest difficulty, there will be no cuts when I die, they will be remained into in the um, it will be remained in the video, I'm not going to cut it unless I die a hundred times, but then I'll let you know that I've died a hundred times and I've cut it. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of some of the sun, just got with the filtering, that's because sometimes uh, it likes to use a lot of my hard drive, I mean graphics card, and because this wasn't optimised to more modern graphics cards such as mine, which is the GTX 770, um, I'm going to turn it down slightly to make sure we have seamless gameplay with no frames drops throughout the game. Now this is going to be forced to record at 30 frames per second as I am not partnered with YouTube. So I will not be able to upload 60 frames per second and we might as well get the best quality that I can out there instead of YouTube forcing it down to 30 frames per second. Everything else is going to remain like this, depth of field, visibility range, small animals, uh, high high high, maybe one part of anti aliasing um, just something else to look forward to during uh, at the summer. Um, I'm going to be uploading a few videos just to explain different parts of the computer. Something that I'm very passionate about. I study two um, ICT related topics at school. And I think I might have crashed. Which would be awkward. I might just have to be right back in a sec. Okay, so we are back after that crash. Not the best start for The Witcher, but you know, we will continue on. Where was I? Can't actually remember where I stopped, so I'll start again. In the summer I'm going to be bring, uh, no, now I remember. So I study two subjects, I do programming and just your normal ICT. Uh, very both, I'm very passionate about it. Just want you to know that I'm going to be doing a quick, like, how to clean a computer, how to put one up, build one, take things out, upgrade components and stuff, but that's something to look forward to. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to hold you here much longer because I want to start the gameplay and I want to get this video out so you guys know it's coming. I'm sorry about Spencer Child 1, I'm about halfway through writing a new script to get it to work on my PC properly. No idea why, if any of you know of any fixes, please do feel free to let me know. And ladies and gentlemen, 
I just want to say again how excited I am to bring you this. I am well aware that Gopher recently did a series on this. I'm not trying to copy him. I started one previously before he did, but I was not happy with the quality that I was putting out at that stage. Um, basically, the last question is, do you want my mic like this, or do you want a higher quality with maybe some background fuzziness going on? There will be a new mic coming, not sure when, but it will be at some point soon. Um, Thank you so much for watching you guys, and I will see you guys very, very soon. Peace out.